What's going on guys? My name is Kobe One Kenobi and welcome to another zombies video today on my channel. And in today's video we will be playing our second challenge of the start room challenge. So today's map will be the giant. So unlike Shadows of Evil, we might make it past level 9 because Shadows of Evil was a really really hard map to do with Margo spawned. So anyway, let's just hop right into the giant. So we're going to try to skip the cutscene. Sorry if it's so glitchy right now, my internet's not the best, it's been raining outside, so it might do okay, but we'll see how this goes. Alright, so the clock just went past 115. It's Rick Toffin. Dempsey right there. Nikolai, and there we go. So there's a new challenge that just came out today, and it's up to the 23rd. If you get the half a billion headshots, you can get these really cool um, uh, calling cards. It would be like all the four main characters. So <laughs> I'm going to try to do my best to get headshots in the round four and higher. Yeah, that's really bad. All right, so... So We're just going to try to get as many points as possible to get up guns, but I will not be opening up any doors as it's a start room challenge, so there are no um, gobble gum machine, gobble gums that can help me on this. Alright, so we'll be shooting guys in the legs eight times. Eight times just to get a lot more points. Yeah, just knife bolt. There, I just end the round. Must work quick. There's so much to do. All right. Um, yeah, actually, we're just gonna get two weapons because the the there's really no point of saving up a lot of weapon money. Confused. But these run, run, fight, all right. So got the RK5 and the Shiva. So our thing we're gonna be trying to do if we've been uh, this is the one spot we're trying to avoid because if we get trapped here, we're dying. And that will end the round for us. So, the strategy is that I can run around the map. I'll try going up here to get a lot of crowds, stand in the corner, and then try to run around them. But if there's more over here, I'll probably die. So, yeah, this map I won't spy very long in the boat. So, like I said, on the last video, it's going to be a lot like the Shadow of Evil. Remind me, this will be going on for the next five days to the 16th because that's when Zombies Chronicle comes out for the PS4. I will be not getting it because it does not come out the same time as Xbox One. Even as a part of his each and every time. So when uh, it starts getting higher rounds, we start rebuilding barriers more frequently. So we can have a little more room to escape the guys. Alright. There we go. We're just getting double points. I don't know why we would need it in here because we won't be. Well, actually, never mind because we have to buy ammo for this just in case they don't have uh, max ammo. This is where we're going to start using our RK5. I do want to apologize for the sound quality. It can go on and off because of the internet connection. I am not doing this off of um, El Gato's. I am actually just live stream streaming this off the Xbox app and on the Camtasia. That's the only way I have known how to do it. I will be doing that. I'll be doing it with an Elgato once I have save up enough to get one. Alright, so we're aiming for the heads because we're going to try to get a half a billion headshots. My highest ever on this map is um, 700, and so we're going to try to make that record uh, at least today. Got two 
Boom, that'll help us out, making it through higher rounds. Alright, so, rebuilding barriers again, just keep going in the motion. Keep going back and forth, rebuilding barriers, killing zombies. Sliding a lot just so we don't get hit so much. Down grenades. Right. That should have helped us out just a bit. Right, so we'll just go buy more ammo for this. Oh, now he gives it to us. Uh, I kind of. I don't know why I had to waste money then. So I don't have to worry about this corner because usually in high rounds if you open up all the doors, um, zombies can crawl over that gate and that's this is the one area you don't want to be during the high round. You want to be more back at generator 2 so that has that little catwalk and everything that you can just camp in the corner and put down trip mines and make sure you have a sniper rifle or a ray gun, wonder waffle, monkey bombs, get all geared up, have all four perks. Yeah, like, World at War camping style. Alright, we're on six. Let's see how well we can do this time. It's just getting tough this half of our ammo is already going through. Good thing I put a fast mag on this gun so we don't need a quick fly for all this. Or no, speed cool, sorry. Quick ride would help us a lot more. Yeah, that's just a good Maybe point. Now I can Give us an extra 400 points. We'll get loaded up on ammo again. So the Shiva won't have any use for us now. It would just be like a gun just put a lot of points. Poor hellhounds. They know right, no so better. for hellhounds we're gonna camp in the corner as well. At the end of the hellhound round they will be giving us some max ammo so that's also good. Alright, we're doing good so far. No hellhounds will touch us. If they touched us, we've been we would have been screwed. will give us a fighting chance. All right. So now we're just waiting for round eight to finally start up because after a while, the it takes a while to spawn in the zombies and everything after the hellhound rounds. That's kind of nice because then you can actually get everything you need. Backing up in the corner again. Alright, that was close. Alright, we're doing good, we're doing good. We're doing good. We're gonna go get ammo in a little bit. 
Actually, we're gonna go get that now so we don't run out. All right, now these are getting more intense. We're doing way better than the um, Shadow's Evil so far. Get some cheap ammo. Just, just a waste of money. So the weapons we will be using for most of these maps will be the RK5 and the uh, Shiva, because those are just the start room weapons. All right, so I'll try to use less grenades this time. Because we gotta save up the four just in case we got a big emergency, or if I get them up a big enough crowd, it can actually hurt, do some damage to them. Yep, round nine. So I knew I wasn't gonna make it through that crowd. That was really tough, but we did a nice try. That was round nine. That's how we ended the Shadows of Evil Easter egg, or. Not Easter egg, but start room challenge. So, yeah, those two pretty tough. The giant and revelation, not revelations. Shadows of Evil are the two maps that just don't have the gobble gums machines inside it. But gobble gum machines will help you with everything if you have good pa good gobble gums. So you can have like perkaholic. I'll give you all nine perks. Um, wall by. So when you get a wall by like the RK5 or Shiva, they will be pack-a-punched, so that actually gives you an advantage to stuff, or then you get and have a max ammo, insta-kill, whatever, and that actually helps you a whole lot. So I'm kind of interested into the next map we're going to be playing for challenge number three, that will be the Eisendrock, because the Panzer sold that will spawn in that map, and I want to see how we can take that thing down with just an RK5 and uh, Shiva. So that's going to be very interesting for uh, tomorrow's video. So yeah. So hope you guys liked this video. Please make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. If you have any thoughts on videos I should make, please leave a comment down below. Um, Render tomorrow's will be. This video will be going for the next five days daily. So, yeah, it'll be a daily upload video. That's all I'm going to say now. So, see you guys all in the next video.